Hey there, everybody. Welcome to lucky number 13 in our 30 songs in 30 days lesson series. Today, we're going to work through another track from my Fuse album. This one's going to be called Even the Stars Fall For You. You ready? Let's get to work. We have a verse, a chorus, a bridge, and a solo section, and the progressions all use four chords that you already know. D, A, E minor, and G, or however you want to play it. And of course, the song's not complete without the intro. So let's learn that first. Okay, here's the intro. As you can hear, the intro starts with a rhythmic strum on the fifth string, fifth fret, right there. It's a D note. And if you count one and two and three and four, and on that last and, you strum the fifth string up to the seventh fret, as in one, two, and three, and four, and. One, two, three, four, and. And we're doing that slide technique. One, two, three, four, and down to the open A. And. Next is the same rhythmic strum, but this time on the seventh fret on the fifth string. One, two, three, four, one, two, three, and. And on that last and, you're going to slide to the ninth fret. And then you're going to slide down to the 6th string, 3rd fret, which is your G note. So you put that all together, and it's like this. One, two, three, four, and A. One, two, three, four, and G. Twice. It's tricky doing the, doing that bit. You, you'll get the hang of it. You may even just start by going. If you can hum it, you'll, I think you'll slowly be able to translate it from being able to hum it to being able to play it. That's what we're working on. And the verse in this song is built using all chords that you already know. Four beats on D, four beats on A, four beats on E minor, and four beats on G. So let's hear it together. Quick palm muted strumming like this. One, two, three, four. 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 Luckily, the chorus is the same as the verse, except we play everything for twice as long and we release the palming because we want to release into the chorus. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, A. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, E minor. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, G. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, Repeat that twice. Make sure to strum in rhythm so that you create the drive that this song needs to really cook. Like If you want, you can even do all downstrokes. It gets a bit more punk that way, but it's like Sometimes it's a bit more aggressive that way instead of playing. This is a little nicer. There's a little more attitude in playing all downstrokes. Like that. Now working on the bridge, 
will first strum eight beats on B minor, which I guess is a little bit of a bridge to the bridge, if you will. It's before the solo, so it breaks up after the second chorus. It goes like this. We're doing one, two, three, four on B minor, two, three, four, and then eight beats on A. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Repeat. That's all taken us in to the solo. Okay, the solo section is another uh, chord progression again, different from the bridge. It's gonna be four beats on E minor, four beats on G, and then it's gonna be eight beats on B minor. And then we're gonna repeat four beats on E minor, four beats on G, Four beats on B minor, four beats on A. So we put that together, it sounds like this. One, two, three, four. 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 And you'll notice between the bridge and the chorus, there never is a D chord. And the reason why it's like that is so when you get to the chorus, you're dying to hear that D chord again. So everything is moving around, never playing the D chord. So by the time you get to the end of the solo and you get to every star up in the sky, it's a, such a great release. So that's why we do it that way. I take your time and think about this song as well in terms of chunks, so in sections. You've got your intro, you've got the verse, next is a chorus, then the intro riff, and then a short verse, then we're back to the chorus, and then of course we have that bridge that's going to take us to the solo section. We finish up with the chorus and play the song out. So let's practice. Hey y'all, this is Even the Stars, Fall for You.
Rocking it out, guys.
your name.